how is it being a female, a, a, a black female in the the corporate slash? Um, it's kind of, it's it's interesting. So you know, at first it was just like, oh, woe is me. I literally had someone tell me, if you were a guy, you'd be so more far along in your career. And I was like, that's interesting. You would say that. They were being honest though. But at the same time, I'm like, whatever blessings are coming my way, God put me in this body and gave me the skin and everything for a reason. So I'm not gonna let society tell me that this, who I am, my identity is not a blessing. So I take, I take it for that and it's continuing again, looking at the glass half full. There are times where I feel like my male counterparts will say something I just said, or they'll say the same thing and it's, it's taken in. And when it comes to me, it's taken with like, oh, caution, and they don't want to move as fast and, and things like that. And I have to understand it is a boys club, but I don't give a fuck. I don't want to be part of your club. I'm building my civil regime over here. So you're going to, whether you like it or not, I tell people, I'm like, cool, it's fine. You don't want to listen to me. Eventually you will. They always come back. So you either take the advice I'm giving you because it's coming from a place of I know my shit. I know what I'm talking about. I'm not, I'm not just making up fluff like I live this. I know marketing. I understand branding. Where well, you can take in what I'm saying. You don't want to listen? Fine, no problem. I'll see you in a couple of months because I'm going to give you the same advice. You should have listened before. I'm not one to like, oh, I told you so and everything else. But they always come back.